brain assessment in pediatric patients is different than with adult patients. Because many of our patients are nonverbal, we tend to use behavioral or observational measures instead. These are used for children who are less than four years old or for any child who is unable to report their own pain due to neurocognitive or communication challenges. The most common pain scale used in pediatrics is the FLAC scale, which stands for face, legs, activity, cry, and consolability. For each one of these categories, a patient may receive a score of zero, a score of one, or a score of two. The total possible pain score, when you add up all of the scores for each category, is 10. Using this patient as an example, we can see that there is no particular expression on her face. Her legs are in normal and relaxed position. She's lying quietly, not crying, and appears to be content and relaxed. Therefore, the flax scale is zero. For older patients, you can use the Wong Baker Faces Paint Scale. This scale uses six cartoon faces representing increasing levels of pain from 0 to 10. We can also use the numeric pain scale for older children who are able to count and relate the value of numbers to others. Remember that an accurate and thorough pain assessment is vital to your success. You will be practicing these skills with your clinical instructors. Remember to reassess pain after every intervention.